Hey, good morning, it's Rihanna. Welcome back to my channel. Good morning. Did you find what you're looking for? Yep. Okay. It's trash day. What? <laughs> you see this adorable llama coffee mug? My no drama llama coffee mug. Do you see that chip right there? I'm just glad it's not broken. Let me show you what happened. That's my coffee. Goodbye, coffee. Yeah, that's your fault. I was sitting here enjoying my coffee, had my coffee sitting on the table. Went to throw his ball with this thing. I swung it back and I bat myself in the forehead. And then I sat it down on the coffee table because on the table outside, because I just hit myself in the forehead and I was astounded that I had managed to do that. He decided to jump on the table to grab his ball. I push him off the table and as I'm doing that, he knocks down my coffee mug and spills my coffee everywhere. Luckily, my mug didn't break. So, all right, so we're not gonna have a bad day today. We're not gonna have a bad day today. Beat it, move. I'll just make myself another cup of coffee. Everything's gonna be okay. Hey, good morning, it's Rihanna. Welcome back to my channel. Take two, let's do this again. All right, so I have to go serve a subpoena this morning at 9.30. I sold some more of my washi and I need to go ship that off. And yeah, I think those are the only things I have planned for today. Normally I would be going to Clear Lake to pick up Riley, but Erin got a new job. And so she is off this week. Um, she starts next Tuesday or next Monday. So I'll be um, picking up Riley for two more weeks and then school's out for summer. And then I'm probably not gonna be doing it anymore um, because by the end of summer, she hopes that she's in a position there by being there long enough that she's able to just go pick up Riley, like take her lunch break late, pick up Riley from school and drop her off. So, but yeah, um, I'm gonna have a good day. I hope you're gonna have a good day too. I don't have a lot of time for that. And when I do, I get sucked into it and all of my time goes to that. So I've tried to stay away from it. I just went and served the subpoena. Now I'm at the post office for the well, shipping the washies. That lady's shipping a planner of some sort. Is she a llama? We'll never know. Um, anyways, I just served the subpoena. Super awesome guy. He's gonna, um, he was really cool. He is willing to sign like any subpoenas I get for that like substation or whatever. So that's really neat. Um, as I was just showing y'all, I'm listening to a new podcast. This is The Uncurated Life. And it is Cindy Gutibaltos. I, I know I jack up her name, but you know, I'm, I'm there. Um, it's her podcast. You've probably heard me mention her several times if you've been on my vlog for a long time, um, but you're not a planner person. If you're a planner person, you definitely know who she is. Um, she's Llama Letters. So if you're into podcasts, you should check it out. It's really good. I'm on the second episode. I'm going to binge listen today. Um, the first episode had me crying while I was driving to meet uh, the sergeant for the subpoena. So I need a tissue warning, Cindy, please. I think my, like, one of my bucket list goals is going to be to be interviewed on her podcast. So anyways, all right, let's go ship this off. <clears throat> let's go ship this off. So I made you food instead. You have you have plasticware. Uh, creations of our <laughs> It's ranch, salsa, and jalapenos. Appreciate it. You're welcome. 
Thank you, sweetie. You're welcome. Or are you just... I think we're gonna go to Rooms to Go uh, whenever Jonathan gets off and order the couch uh, that we looked at the other day. We've decided that we want it. Um, but first, I need to measure this space and make sure that the couch isn't too big. I don't think it is. It's a pretty small couch. But just to be sure, we're gonna make sure. Just to be sure, we're gonna make sure. <laughs> so, here to there is 89. And then here to here, that one, is 69, which is how far the chaise is, because it's a, it's three cushions, and on the third cushion is a chaise, but the chaise is reversible. So we could do, we could do that, and um, obviously what we can do is we can put the fish tank over there, or shoot, we could put it over there, move this over, and put the kennel somewhere else. Kennel, this is this room is totally like rearrangeable. I think it'll be fine. And we can put the chaise, if we feel like it's too crowded, we can always put the chaise up against the wall. So I think it's good. I've got my little desk area pretty much all organized and set up. I went through all of my swag. I don't know if I told you this. I don't think I did. I've gone through all of my swag from Go Wild. This is everything that I'm keeping in this box right here. Everything in those two bags, the like the plastic bag and the Michaels bag, are to be given away or done as a giveaway. Does that make sense? So like, I'm either gonna gift them to people or uh, my my low. I'm either gonna gift them or I'm gonna do a giveaway for my channel. Probably do a couple giveaways and then I know a couple of things that I'm gonna be gifting. But anyways, okay. Um, but it's going crazy because there's a reflection from the sun that's hitting my screen on here and it's making a reflection on the wall. We're at Rooms to Go now, as you can hear and see. And we're setting up our account to purchase. We're getting the couch, like I said, two bar stools, and a rug. So the downstairs will be pretty much done, I think. Um, oh no, still need a dining room table, but that's gonna wait a little bit longer. What are we doing? <laughs> Making it fit. You think we can. This rug is going in my tiny car. We should have taken the truck. Why don't we bring the truck? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's fine to be folded. It's not a big deal. Here's the rug. We're gonna unroll it. Here it is. The rug. So we went, after we got the stuff from Rooms to Go, we went to dinner at Brew Wings. Oh my gosh. Guys, if you like wings and you have a Brew Wings in your area, it's better than Buffalo Wild Wings and Wingstop in my opinion. They're super crispy. I really like my wings to be very, very crispy. And their ranch tastes like, um, this is traditional wings, like bone and wings. Um, we don't get boneless, obviously, because of keto. Um, but their ranch tastes like Wingstop's ranch, which is delicious. But I'm doing the pee pee dance. That's why I'm walking around in circles. So I'm wrapping the vlog. And I'll see y'all tomorrow. Oh, um, I'm filming my Go Wild Q&A thing tomorrow. So when you're watching this, if it's like still early in the day. If you're watching this before like maybe three or four o'clock on Wednesday, May 16th, you can still put your questions in. But all right, subscribe, click the thumbs up button, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. My mouthful. I bet you if you put a little bit of that nut butter on top of this cracker, it'd be delicious. Let's try it.